If you're anything like me, you're chatting away with your coworkers on a regular basis in Microsoft Teams. The one question I get quite frequently is how do I delete the chat when it's no longer needed? The answer used to be, I'm sorry, the best you can do is hide it. But good news, that answer has changed. Now you can delete a chat in Microsoft Teams from your view. I have navigated to Microsoft Teams and I am opening the chat pane from the left-hand navigation menu. Deleting the chat is fairly simple, but there is one quirky thing that I have discovered related to meeting chats, so let's start there. Whenever you have a meeting, there will be a corresponding chat on your list, and it is represented by this purple calendar icon. What I have noticed is if I am the organizer of a meeting, I cannot delete the chat. But if I am an attendee, I can delete to my heart's content. I do love a well-organized chat pane. The Microsoft documentation does not address why there is a difference. My best guess is that if the organizer deletes the chat, some of the associated files may also be impacted, such as the attendance roster, which only the organizer can see. Other than meetings, you can delete group chats, one-on-one -on -one chats, or even messages sent by Teams bots. Let's walk through this. I'm going to select the group chat with me, Nestor, and Adele and click on Delete Chat. A floating dialog box appears and it will let you know that this will permanently delete the chat for you, but not the other people. So in this example, Adele and Nestor can keep going on with the chat, I just won't be in it. It's very similar to leaving the chat, except that it takes it out of your chat pane so you don't have to keep looking at it. Now I will go back to the chat pane and choose a private chat. Click on the three dots and select delete. This will remove the chat for me, but not the other person. They can still see the whole thread. If you shared any files, those will have to be taken care of separately. Now, typically I use this one when I am no longer working with the person and I don't need to see the chat anyway. I have logged in as Nestor so you can verify what the other person will see. Notice this chat with Adele. It used to be a group chat, but now it is a one-on-one. -on -one. If you look at the bottom, it says Heather left the chat. This is one indicator for them that I am no longer part of this thread. Okay, so now you know how to delete a chat in Teams. For more tips like this, check out my Teams playlist and I'll see you there.